remember also recent interview with Haley Bailey uh, with Hollywood Reporter. She is opening up about all the uh, backlash she got ever since she got cast as a Little Mermaid uh, Ariel. And when I see this article, I'm like, ha, huh, I personally, I never thought this movie will get this much uh, like backlash from the audience. Like they, really, the first trailer when it dropped, it got so many dislikes, which I had no idea about. I guess, uh, I don't know. Uh, personally, I think Haley, for her to go through all this thing, you know, it didn't really boost her career or nothing. She just got all this. Uh, this life from people, I guess, because when I was uh, like before I making this video, I was scrolling to her Instagram. There's a lot of comment on her page. People are like, you know, why did you do this? Uh, people are calling her out. Obviously, she's uh, facing all this thing. Uh, and I'm here thinking someone who is a reviewing movie here. I will say the biggest problem with uh, like this character when they first shown in the first picture, like uh, like, I don't know how this movie is. I don't know anything about it. I think the trailer first teaser looked good. The other day they dropped the TV spot. I think it looked okay. Some of the part didn't look that good probably because this movie isn't done. Like this movie is going to be done end of the March. Uh, so that is why some of the scene it looks good. Some of the scene it didn't. Uh, well, I don't know how she is as the actor. Hayley Bailey, which is really important <laughs> when you were in a movie. Of course, it is important. Although she can sing, her voice is amazing when she sings Out of the Sea. Uh, I think for me personally, I think the biggest mistake with this uh, as her costume is her hair. You know, her hair, they try to give those natural look, like the how the radish her hair is. It's not how the cartoon aerial hair is. Uh, now you can see oh you know how can she get that hair uh but i think if they gave her those uh, red bright red wig at least give her that i think it couldn't work honestly i don't think people are so mad about her uh, color of her skin as much as they're mad about her hair i think personally because i was showing this trailer to some normal people and they're like oh this looks interesting. At uh, same time, they pointed out that her hair why is not red, you know, because I think this is one of her features. It's supposed to be bright red hair. And uh, that is what I think, like, of course, I'm not saying that is the only thing people uh, people to bother her, but it could have been easier if they gave her that uh, because you cannot make it too natural looking. That is the problem these days, you know. It need to be, because end of the day, it is under the water, you know, it's not real, but that's why I liked Aquaman movie, how it was, uh, it was a CGI happy, but you know, when was Aquaman was under water, it felt like you were in that uh, fantastic world, you know, I know, I'm not talking about those laser beam stuff, I'm talking about when he was under the water, this world didn't felt like too real, like, uh, because if it feels too real, it freaks people out. <laughs> uh, I think it need to be normal. That is her, yeah. I do think she needed that red wig. Uh, but I think, I personally think, because so far, Disney, they didn't do any good advertise for this movie. They are too afraid. You can't be afraid. That is my like problem with it. You know, why are you so afraid? Just... Like, you know, when you are, you're making movie, it can't be too much like realistic stuff, you know. Always, whenever you're making movie, it's about the story, it's about the character. It's not about the actor who plays the character, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's always about the character. It's not about the person playing it, you know. Uh, because end of the day, all this backlash she got from this movie, it didn't help this actress, you know. People just see her, this person who uh, taking over. That means her, yeah. I remember when the first Aladdin trailer came out, people did freaked out about that movie. So <laughs> I could see this movie being still hit if it's good, you know. Uh, all this backlash she's getting, probably because so far all the trailer didn't do that much justice. And uh, yeah, I do think she needed this bright red wig uh, because of, uh, there was another Little Mermaid character, like she wasn't like a little, I guess, in that, you know, the once upon a time that show had a Little Mermaid too, and her hair was red, you know, what is wrong with giving her red hair? 
No, they went with her hair, basically look like my hair and people get mad at that. Yeah, I understand it. <laughs> also, I understand uh, why are so many people mad at this. Then again, we have not seen the movie, so we don't know. Uh, personally, I'm really excited to see this because I really like Underwater Story. Uh, that is what I'm going to say about this, all this backlash she's facing. And that's my thought on this. Let me know in the comment. What do you think about all the backlash Hailey Bailey will, uh, she's been facing? If you enjoyed this video, don't forget my other videos on other topics. If you enjoyed this, please subscribe. Until I see you next time, please take care.